Welcome back everybody to our Let's Play series on Medieval Dynasty. So it, we are in uh, summer season now. Uh, I think it's day two. And um, last night I did a little bit more collecting of some some uh, more logs and some more berries uh, just to you know have on hand. Um, Let's see what do we want with the hammer so I, I still need to you know get some more for the for the food storage um, some more uh, of everything really but um, yeah so oh and one other thing I have kind of rethought through um, let's actually just take these sticks and do we have any No, we don't. I need some more. I need to go collect some more straw. Um, uh, but before I forget, I want to change. Uh, where is it? Settings, customize game. So, I know eight day seasons are really long, um, and I think it's it's a little overkill. So I'm gonna switch it to five. Now that won't take place. Like, like right, it says right here, it won't change until next season. Uh, but we should we should still be able to select. Oh, see, accept changes. There we go. Um, we should be able to fast forward once we get far enough in the summer season. Um, one thing, um, what I want to do first is I actually want to start or not start uh, finish crafting the food storage because I do want to try to get some more villagers here soon I'm just gonna cut these two down Where are the other logs oh those should be three with the spruce right oh it's over there Hiding. Okay. Not sure if that's enough logs, but we'll see. Okay. And there. And there. Oh no, definitely not enough. Oh yeah, we're gonna need a lot of logs. Huh. Okay. Ooh. All right, so let me go get some straw. Um, yeah, they, they'll grow back. Let's so cut these down. What I'd also like to do today is I'd like to go over to the farming portion of the village and, um, I think I realized the we have the equipment we need to, to harvest what we want to over there. Um, I just don't think I was angled the right way to make it work. Um, so we'll have to go over there and uh, reevaluate that. Actually, I don't know if I need sticks. I do need some, but I have plenty. Nice. Okay, so the walls are done. Um, is it over here? Yeah. Four logs there. Alright, so what else do we need? Four logs. Make another, yeah, another four over there. So eight, nine, ten. Eleven, twelve. Twelve more logs and some straw. I'm going to go over here and get some straw, and I'll probably pick up some logs while I'm over there as well. Reeds. You 
Yeah, I haven't decided if I'm going to keep going on the um, storyline yet. I think I'm probably going to take some time away from doing missions um, because I was very heavily on missions in the first first season. Um, I think it's probably best if I just focus on on the village and and getting that up to speed. And actually, let me check real quick. Management. Um, okay, so yeah, I can build more things. I can have up to 10 right now. I also kind of got to get the, uh, the farm quest finished. Um, so I need to go to the... Go into town, probably on the way, and... And buy those seeds. Because we can plant uh, cabbage. So we might as well plant some cabbage. If I remember right, the villagers... Cabbage is decently high on the... Uh, oh wow. Uh, there's like a preference for, for what the villagers will eat first. I guess I take this big tree. And cabbages are like the first like raw thing from what I remember that are that are on that list. So pretty useful. Apparently they they're good enough to eat raw. Cool. Little overburdened. Yeah, and I like this house location better. Um, I think I might end up, I know it's a waste of resources, but I might end up getting rid of that just because it's not really in, oh, we have another squished bird. I wait to build another trap. Um, oh, it's decorative. Yeah, I need two more stone. Uh, buttons. Yeah, I just don't like the location of it. I feel like it's kind of in the middle of, of everything. I have to get some stones when I have more movement. Come on. Okay. I think it's just these two left. Done? Yes, done. Cool. Alright, did I put any food in here? Um, well, these berries were going to let rot, so that's not a huge deal. Ah, uh, the meat. Onions. Of course, those are probably going to rot. Salt and meat. Um, what else? Salt? That's this resource. Flour? No. Okay. That'll be good for now. We'll put the onions in there, even if they eventually turn to rot. Um, yeah. Let's put some cabbages in there. Just in case I end up picking up a villager 
want to make sure there's some food in there. Um, I also need to get water. Um, let's see. So I could build a well. But if I build a well, I also need buckets. So I might prioritize building a uh, workshop. Production workshop. Um, and that'll allow me to uh, make some buckets. So let's see. Let's put it over here, kind of like in the production corner. Um, let's see, can I get it over here? Yeah, that looks good. All right. Um, for now, though, I'm actually just going to leave that and build that later. I want to run over to the to the farm. I haven't decided what I want the villager to work on first. I might try to find. I guess it depends on what what villager we find and what they're good at. <laughs> um, I would like to find someone who can farm for us just to take a little bit out of um, what we have to do over there. Uh, I will need to make sure they have enough tools and everything though. So again, like, I, I really need to get kind of my villagers going, but I also don't want to rush it because the last thing I want to do is to, you know, you get into a point in this game where it's like once you start getting villagers, you just, you know, you keep needing them and you get more and more and more and more. And I don't really want to get too behind, so I want to make sure I'm ready for the first one before I pull the trigger on it. Um, actually, let's eat some food too before Rasmir gets angry at us. Um, let's eat these flatbreads. This one. Maybe here. run through the water to clean off a little bit, since we're dirty. Is that clean? Yep, clean. Nice ducks. Where's my... Let's try to get a duck. Nice. So one other thing I, I want to get going, um, just be, like, uh, like what I was saying before with the villagers, um, to make sure they have enough tools and things, I would like to actually get a resource storage built where I want to mine. Um, now, actually building the mine is pretty far out. Um, you can make like a... Ooh, some extra stuff. Oh, I already looted this. Oh, some leather. I missed that. And a knife. Um, yeah, so... The vine is pretty far out, so I won't be making that anytime soon. But if I put a resource storage up and mine myself, anything I put in there is usable to, you know, like craft some um, some tools out of. And I, it'll just be a lot easier to craft tools that aren't stone tools um, for the villagers, since you won't have to replace them as much. So. Stone sickle. Let's equip that. Let's put it on six. Yeah, I don't think I was doing this at the right angle. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, and it looks like I already planted cabbage. Forgot about that. All right. Yep, that's all of it. Sticks. So another, speaking of sticks, another nice thing about the, the workshop, once I have it built, is you can make, um, it's only $50 or 50 coin, <laughs> I say dollars a lot, 50 coin to, to buy the scheme for, I think it's a small wicker basket, and um, I know you can, I, you can make a decent amount of money off of, um, making those because it just takes sticks and and then selling them and it, it's a good way to increase your uh, your experience a little bit too so I think I'm not I don't think I'm gonna hold off on buying seeds um, is there anything else we want to do here don't think so um, this will be the nice thing about having someone working here um, let me stop at Estovia see if there's any good recruits on my way back yeah, and like I said I don't think we're 100% ready for them but um, I just want to get an idea of of who we're looking at. It's usually a yeah, there it's, it's usually a hawk up on this. Oh, there's two. Oh, oh we got one. Or eagle, not hawk. Since we're gonna need some meat, so I had to remember to go in there and cook all that before it turns the rot, so potential villagers have something to eat. Now they're gonna eat the cabbage first. Here, actually, I'll just show you. Um, is it management? Yeah. So if you go to food items, um, this is the priority. Of course, I don't have any of these. The first thing I have... Um, I thought cabbage was higher. Yeah, it's cabbage. So they eat the cabbage, they eat the salted meat, then they eat any rested meat. So they won't eat... Onions are down there. They won't eat the raw meat until, you know, it gets to that point. Which, you know, is not good, because you don't want to poison your villagers. Um, I'm gonna need stones. Maybe I'll put some stones on the way back. That way. Um Oh yeah, villagers. Almost forgot what I was gonna do. Okay, we got Miro Niegua, she's good at hunting and crafting, that's not too bad. Uh, Zybert, uh, ones and twos, and Albreda, just a three in crafting. So if out of these three, I would probably go with her. Um, she could do some hunting for us and get us some meat, which could be useful. Um, or she can craft us wicker baskets um, with sticks so yeah I think about that uh, I think I'm gonna wait at least a day and um, just get a little more prepared so yeah I want to get the the workshop built and I think that should be 
good for now. Because um, we can already make our own planks. Um, yeah, at some point, I think we really just need to get, get some stones while I'm out here. We really just need to get some villagers to start working on things so I don't have to do everything. Um, kind of streamline it a little bit better. I feel like you can never have too many sticks. But that was like something special, it's just a rock. I needed 12 stone. You can also have, I mean, you can't have too much stone because it weighs down. It weighs you down a little too much, but at the same time, I feel like I always need stone. Some up on as I'm walking. You just like mash the key, you end up picking picking some things up. Okay. Um let me pull out this bit of these stone. Drop off. Oh, that's a lot of feathers to carry. Uh, let's drop that off. Um, yeah, probably should have left this back at the barn, but that's okay. Drop the leather off. Um, I don't think I need to carry all these. So let's. That one. Actually, we're just I shouldn't have done that. I should keep. Let's keep that one. Um, the hell in there too. Okay. Uh, let's just keep all the meat together. I had to take that out, and probably the, tonight when it when it gets dark, or, or go off camera and, and do that. So let's cut some more trees down. Let's do some over here, away from the village. Iron Axe is really nice. It'll be a it'll be a sad day when it goes. Suppose I should probably get a stone knife to do those extra hits. Um, I saw someone talking about that, how technically it always takes two hits to do that, no matter which axe you have. So you might as well use a stone one for it. Which I guess makes sense, but I'm not too worried about it, to be honest. I believe this is open, so this shouldn't need too much more once we get the framing. Oh yeah, just roof. Nice, we might... Oh, we might be a little short on straw. Yeah, we're gonna be a little short on straw. It's fine, I can go grab grab that real quick. dark already. There's always birds in my camp. Let's thin out the birds. Oh no! I don't think I ever made another 
trap. Where are my traps at? Do not. So let's do bird trap. Eventually when we get into the farming, we should have plenty of straw made from like wheat and stuff. Okay, it's good for now. Throw the bow out. I think this house just kind of sits awkwardly in the middle of the village. I have to think about how I want to do that. Boom. Cool. Alright, so. How much gold do I have? I have... So here are those small wicker baskets. Um, it's 50 coin. I only have 93. And I need to get some more coin to get buckets. Because that my main concern with buckets is I need, I need to be able to make those so I can provide water. Because um, right now I don't have any water for the villagers. So I think I will just do this. And let's craft some. Oh, I can make a lot. Um, maybe I'll do this off camera as well. So let me back out. See if there's... Uh, actually, let me go get some water myself. And eat some food. Um, what do I have to eat? Clap bread. some water. I also want to get this meat out. Uh, not the rest of the meat. Here we go. And I'll leave those in there for now. Make a bunch of rest of the meat for the village, so... Alright, I'm I will be right back. I'm gonna while it gets dark, I'm gonna work on making as many wicker baskets as we can. Oh, wrong spot. And also roasting some meat. And then I'll probably just skip ahead to the next day. And then we can go in town, sell some, and um I think we might be ready to pick up the villager. So yeah, see you see you tomorrow, I guess. All right, we are back. It is morning. Um, I made... Ooh, we got some more meat. Of course. I just cooked all the meat. Um, I don't have enough sticks. Okay, well, there's sticks over here. Everything we need is just lying on the ground. I think that was enough. Yep. We set the rabbit trap. There we go. Okay, so I'm gonna go put all this meat in the storage. Um, roasted meat. I'm gonna hold on to the fifty percent. Doing the wrong thing. There we go. Okay. Um, and then I have the wicker baskets on me, so I could use that for some cash. Um, so yeah, let's go into town. 
going to sell all the wicker baskets and um I'm contemplating whether I want to buy the stuff to finish chapter 5. Um, when we pick the cabbage next season, we should get we should get at least 15 cabbage seeds out of it, I would think. Um, and that would save us a little money from having to buy them. Um, carrots we can plant... I think we can plant in the winter, actually. And wheat... I can't remember if wheat is in... You can plant it in the spring, because it takes two months. Um, but then I can't remember if it's the winter. I think it's actually the fall. But then it doesn't finish until summer. So, <clears throat> yeah. Um, no one to sell things over here. Where's Edwin? Should be in here. No? Is it too early in the morning? Everyone's still waking up. Oh, you're right here, Adelina. I'm good. Wow, you're really tall. Okay. Um, would you like some wicker baskets? I have 33 of them. 247. So yeah, not too bad. Just for essentially needing sticks. See you soon. Well, you change your outfit really fast. Oh, it's kind of impressive. Uh, so we're now. He doesn't sell seeds. Where is Edwin? There's his icon. Is this you? Edwin! I'm good. Um, turn your orders. So let's buy... Um, I don't think I need to waste money on fertilizer. I need to buy carrots. And I need 15. And I need to buy... the other one. Wheat? Is that gonna put me... Oh yeah, wheat is expensive. Uh, let's, let's hold off on that. I need at least a hundred coin for buying the scheme for buckets. So yeah, those, those worker baskets aren't the most profitable, but I mean, I made, I made back already what I cost what I spent on them so um, yeah I think we're I think we're gonna pull the trigger on this we're gonna use her for a hunter I think to start we're in Yegua. yeah let's uh let's talk how is life treating you oh it is great uh small talk John your mind Spent most of my life in the valley. I wonder what lies beyond the ridge. But caution tells me curiously killed the cat. Did I already talk to her? I'm not sure if I did. Tell me about your skills. Really into tracking prey since it's unpredictable and thrilling. Every hunt is except yeah. So she's a hunter. That's fine. We're we're good. Let's um starting a new settlement. Looking for people willing to join. Sounds what I was looking for. With pleasure. Sweet. There we go, first villager. Let's uh, make sure she she's not happy right now. We need to assign her to a house. Uh, empty slot. Yep, cool. So she has her house, and uh, she will... I think the food and water... Or food and wood will go away. We can see our... Water demand is zero, or our water supply is zero. So I need to go go do that right now. It would it will be nice to get a woodworker as well because they can um, produce things like logs and sticks. And actually, is she good at? Oh, let me check. So is that extraction? Yeah, that's extraction. She 
She's not good at extraction. She has a two in extraction. Just thinking, I I might. You know what? I'm gonna do that. She's she's gonna be our hunter eventually. I think I'm gonna start her out in the woodshed. Um, yeah, she's got a two, so it's not too bad. Um, just because I wanted to start collecting some of this. Now the firewood, I could have her make firewood, but I could also make those myself. Um, let's get her getting some sticks, logs, let's do a little extra logs, let's do 40%, um, and then some planks, which of course you need logs for, so it says no resources. I am going to make sure I need to put some axes in there for her. Um... Let's do another 10% here. It's about almost 20 a day. That's pretty good. Let's get some more sticks. Because we're going to use the sticks to craft some wick wicker baskets from it. So it's almost 21 a day. That's pretty good. Um, I am hungry and thirsty. Let's eat some of this meat before it goes back. Drink of water. Okay, so we need to go build some buckets and pick up some water and put it in the food storage so our new villager doesn't go thirsty. She would not be too fond of us if, if that were if that were the case. Um, where is it? Okay. Yeah, yeah, you're tired. I get it. It's fine. Alright, so, bucket. Bye. And, yeah, I need some planks. Which, I don't have any planks. So, let's cut the tree down. Let's do this one. Looks good to me. I don't want to wait for her to have a log. Oh. Where's the other one? Oh, jeez. It's like... <laughs> that's weird. Okay. Let's make some planks. Let's do all of them. And then we can we can make as many buckets as, as we can make from planks for this, um, and that should be plenty of water for the long term. Because once the buckets are out, I mean we could just refill them. They should last. I don't know how many they're going to last, but they should last a decent amount of refills. Uh, how many can I make? Four. Yeah, four should be good. Looks like you're making a cup instead of a bucket. Did she arrived to our village yet? I haven't seen her. She should be working over there. Ooh, new level in production. Let's see what we got. Right, so I already have all the crafting. Let's do let's do builder. Save our hammers a little bit. Okay. Um buckets. Oh, I have them. So I just need to equip. Put it in six. Fuck it. 
Oh, hello. Welcome to the village. All right, bye. Where's she going? Oh, she's taking the path. That's fine. <laughs> I'm going to get you some water so you're not mad at me anymore. We had four, right? Yeah, four. Okay. I'm coming with your water. Do you want it? Or do you just want it in here? I, I just put it in here for you. Okay. Just keeps walking. All right. Oh, yep, our little alert went away. Perfect. She's going to get going on some wood crafting. Let's see, let's watch her work. Oh, she changed. Put her work clothes on. Nice. First villager. Let's, let's, uh, let's take a screenshot of that. Nice. Cool. Yeah. First villager. All right. So we're definitely going to need to get some more villagers. Um, like I said, I want to move her to hunting, which is a little bit more proficient. Um, sooner rather than later, I just need to get some wood first. Um, maybe if we can find someone who's good with extraction. Um, then we won't have to worry about that. I also want to build a resource storage and food storage over in the farming area. Um, and also a resource storage over where we want to mine. So lots of building. I think, I think I'd rather do that, get the, the bulk of the, I'm just kind of in the menus while I'm talking, but get the bulk of the um, storage areas built first, I think is probably the best way to go um, before I worry about too much production. That way I don't have to worry about it later. And they should, I haven't ever actually tried it, but I've heard from people that, I'm just going to hunt this bird while I'm talking, It they, they should all connect. So it will it'll be nice to like easily move resources uh, between the different areas um, if I get those built. So that way, like I can go to the mine myself, mine a whole bunch of like copper. I'll probably just start with copper, put it in the resource storage, come back here and put it together. So that should should work out for us. Hopefully it works out as I'm thinking. Okay. Nice. It's going to be so many things to work on. It, it's like almost a little overwhelming on what I should do next. Um, like I would also like to get a kitchen. I'm just going to craft, craft this meat while I'm talking. Yeah, I also want to get a kitchen to get, um, you know, someone working there to constantly supply food um, especially once we get our farm going and we have a, a good um, source of food coming in every year that's that's also another reason why I wanted to lower the amount of days um, because I mean we're still in year one and I think this game is kind of meant to not take that long and you know go through the days and, and years relatively quickly um, but like I said I I just really wanted to start out um, get started slower and kind of get everything going before I um, pass through everything so quickly so all right so in terms of buildings I want to go make a I want to do any quests. 
could go talk to Alan. I might save that for tomorrow. Yeah, I think I'll save that for tomorrow. Let me put some of this roasted meat away. Resource storage. Get rid of some of our extra stuff. Uh, let's put the carrot seed away. Burr. Sticks and stones. Draw. Yeah. Oh, and the feathers. Oh, and the ceilings, too. Alright, I think uh, that's probably a good spot to end. Um, I'll do a little bit more thinking on exactly what the plan is. Um, since right now I'm kind of not not sure what I want to do yet. So uh, let me do a little more thinking of that. Um, this video will be a little bit shorter than the others, but I was getting a little carried away getting over an hour. So I think kind of a shorter video is, is kind of a good place to end. And, 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 and hey, I mean got some pretty good progress we got uh you know some crafting areas built and we got our first villager just working hard already so so yeah thanks thanks for watching um and i hope you join me again next time have a good one